Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Welcome back to Hatchet Gaming, and we are opening up box number two. Time to hunt some more QCRs. Hopefully we get a full willows and another QCR out of this box. We are now two for two the past two videos on our QCSRs. And hopefully we can get a third today. Can't forget the crown. It is coming clutch the past couple of videos. And now. I'm ready for more shiny cardboard. If you guys have not seen the past couple of videos, go check them out. Got some really good cards. A lot of fun, shiny, beautiful things. And uh, let's see. We still need another Mulcharmy. Let's go Rage of the Abyss. And well, boys and girls, we are still trying to climb up the ranks. So if you have not subscribed yet, go ahead and hit the like, subscribe, so you can enjoy all these beautiful videos. Dark Drake Levice. Working our way up to that 500 sub mark. Azumina Debtors for our second super of the box. Well, the secret was so, has shown up by now on the other one, and so did the QCR. So this is probably going to be an ultra rare. Oh, another super Goblin Biker Grand Breakout. It's wrong. Okay, so maybe you can't map these boxes. I really want that Fuelos, man. Give me that $150 secret rare. And another Azumina Moa Regina. Okay. And after we open this box, we also have some beautiful mail to, to show you guys. A lot of uh, dollar whatnot purchases. And Fiend Smith's Agnum Day. But man, I got some amazing cards to show you guys today. So hopefully you stick around. Hit Flipping Feline, Mint Man, Poseidon Splash, Samurai, and a Metal Illusionist. Come on, number 32. Show us what you got. And, all right, hey, yo, I will take a Fire King Courtier Volcanics for sure. It's not too bad. It's not Dominus Purge or Fuelos. What not a TCG player will definitely sell fairly quickly. And yes, I do have a whatnot channel. I have a link in the description for $15 off your first purchase, as long as it's a new account. And as a Mina Ilya Sylvia. Look at them wolfy boys. And you don't even have to use that $15 on uh, my channel. You can use it for anything that you're looking for, whether it be sports memorabilia, trading cards, coins. It's all up for grabs. 
and Cursed Fire King Doom Burst. Okay. Determination, Splash, Chaos Allure Queen, and Poseidra Abyss, the Atlantean Dragon Lord. More water support. Beautiful. I have one Molcharmy Perulia. I have one Molcharmy Fuelos. I would like to get at least one or two more Fuelos, preferably the QCR version, of course. And final bringer of the end times. Max Metalmorph. And a Rescue Hedgehog. Well, the right side is done. Let's see what the left side has. Mimigul Fairy. I'm definitely starting to keep a hold of all of my Mimigul stuff. I need to go back a set or two and open up a couple more boxes and see if I can pull the rest of the uh, the first wave of Mimi Gold support or Mimi Gold's release. I kind of want to build a RPG style or MMO style um, pull game for whatnot. I'm cooking something up. It's going to be a lot of fun. More details will be announced in the future. I have yet to see anybody run a pull game like that, but as long as I can figure out how to do it within the uh, terms of service of but not, we'll definitely make it happen. And another Ilya Sylvia. All these Asamina cards. Goblin Biker's gone wild. And a Mermail Shadow Squad. Oof. This box ain't looking too good. We'll see what the second secret is. And the Live Virtue Dragon. All right. We got one more Ultra and one more secret left. Six Samurai support. And Battle Wasp Grand Partisan. Oh, holy shit. We did it, boys and girls. We got a Fuelos. No, we didn't get a QCR version, but this is still a 140 something dollar card, and holy crap, this is Moltrami Fuelos number two, boys and girls. If we can get one more of these, we are in some good dang shape. And we already do have a uh, the next and possibly last Moltrami that's been a lot announced that's going to let you draw cards for when people play in their graveyard and banishment. So, of course, you already know that we're going to be looking for those as well when they come out. I think it was like Crossover Breakers is when it's going to be coming out. We'll see. All right, we got an Anishi. 
And I don't know if you guys have seen any of the uh, Bonanza reveals, but I did see a Magic Cylinders, and that was definitely one of the ones that I wanted on that list. So, so far, so good. If they can make sure that there's also like a QCR Monster Reborn, Mirror Force, Jinzo. Oh my god, we'll be so happy. First Fire King Doom Burst, but I'm already seeing a lot of people starting to downplay oh my god bonanza 3 they're screwing us over again it's like well we're only gonna get one and i don't even think they've announced anything that's going to be out of that 200 card nostalgia pool so i mean i think it's a little early to start complaining is this the last ultra and it is area the water charmer I don't think we've pulled this one yet. But hey, we'll take a charmer. Nice. Let's pack magic. Last box that I saw with the Fuulos in it definitely had a QCR also, and you're actually gonna see. I didn't get the Fuulos. If I would have bid one more rip till you hit, I would have gotten a QCR and a Fuulos, and I would have three of these. But I wasn't trying to be greedy. And the other guy that was kind of doing rip till you hits along with me wound up getting it. And I'm I'm not mad about it, but hey, it's all part of the game. And for our last super, it's gonna be Primite Roar. Holy shit guys. Three amazing openings back to back, two back. Two QCRs, one Fuwalos. And a Dominus Impulse. And Olkenix. Yo, we're cooking, guys. This week has this. Actually, the past few openings have just been freaking amazing. Like I said, if you haven't seen them yet, go ahead and take a look. And for Mail Day. So, guys, if you are still here at this point in the video, leave a thumbs up. If you have not subscribed yet, go ahead and hit subscribe. I don't even care if you hit that freaking bell on the, uh, on the icon thing, man. Like, I don't have a lot of notifications for myself. I really don't care if y'all have notifications for me either, but if you want to, go ahead and hit that that uh that little bell. And to start, we have this blue letter, Dark Magician Girl. I believe she was one of the dollar auctions that I bought into. A Platinum Secret, Iris Sword Soul. The first run of Platinum Secrets had a rarity one. I'm so glad they changed it. Very beautiful. PCR, Cosmic Cyclone, love the texture and foiling. This was from the Millennium Rares channel. I hopped in, spun a wheel for I think either $12 or $22, landed on the jackpot, and, and wound up getting this beautiful Elemental Hero Bubble Man. CRV, what's CRV? I'll, I'll have to look it up. It'll be... It'll be on the screen. Then we also got this beautiful ultimate rare Dark Magician from the starter decks. We now have a copy of the Blue Eyes, and now we also have a copy of Dark Magician. They really should do one for Red Eyes as well, but you know, fuck Red Eyes, right? Then also another one of the dollar uh, auctions was a Galaxy Eyes Cypher Dragon. A Phantom Knights at Breaksword, also a dollar auction. I'm buying up all QCRs. If, if, you, if you're going to run it for a dollar or so, I'm probably going to buy it. Uh, because at this point in time, once the QCRs quit quit showing up, market starts drying up in a year or two. And yeah, I expect a vast majority of these cards to pretty much increase in value a little bit. XYZ Dragon, Dragon Cannon. Number 15, Gimmick Puppet Giant uh, giant Grinder. The one yellow gadget that I was missing. I have two reds, two greens, and now I have at least a full set of gadgets. Chaos Ancient Gear Giant. Another beautiful QCR for the binder. A right arm of the Forbidden One. I think I still need one right leg. I think I need a right leg to complete my second set. And last but not least, the boy himself. 
UCR, Blue Eyes White Dragon. And today, out of the stuff that I've gotten, I gotta say, probably the Blue Eyes and the Fuulos that we pulled today. Mm -mm -mm. Man, just look at that. What a beautiful day for cards. Mm. All hail the king, baby. Hot damn. I need to get in another box. So it looks like I'm going to be going to my local card shop uh, Monday. And I'm going to be grabbing me at least another box or two of, uh, of Rage of the BS if they have it. Uh, coming up, we will also be having a box battle between Light of Destruction mini boxes, Rage of the Abyss mini boxes, and Retro Pack 1 mini boxes. Hope to see you guys there, and peace.